Texaco, once a giant in the oil industry, faced a daunting problem back in 1984 when they set their eyes on purchasing Getty Oil, which seemed like a strategic business move to purchase their competitor, but it turned into a legal nightmare. And then as a result, it took them several years, I think 1987, they settled a lawsuit and decided to pay $3 billion after they found themselves in bankruptcy, chapter 11, and they had to come back from that. Now, now, what's the big takeaway for you as a CEO as you're listening right now that you can do what Texaco did? Number one, it takes flexibility. Number two, it takes agility. But here's the third part. It takes a well-oiled sales machine with sales leadership. As a result, Texaco changed their sales strategy, found themselves back in the game, worked their way to the top, all because they focus on their sales strategy with sales leadership. You do those two things and you will see your sales go up.